Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna attempt something that is probably not a good idea. Uh -huh. Yeah, today I'm gonna be trying to paint my model, my my Minneapolis airport runway without paint pens. I'm gonna try to do the runway markings without paint pens. So yeah, let's get into this. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to be using electrical tape today and I'm going to outline what I've already drawn on the runway, which is the touchdown zone mark things. I used this, this block thing, um, to kind of, you know, draw out like what it looks like. I just traced around that block. It's kind of the size of what I need it to be. So I just did that. Now I'm placing the electrical tape around it so that you know I can I can paint it and it'll look good without any paint pens, which is going to be a challenge because I mean <laughs> paint pens are very useful and it's kind of hard to do airport runways that are neat without you know, using paint pens, which. Which is what I'm gonna be attempting today. <laughs> this will be an interesting video, guys. I haven't really done it. I'm gonna just finish putting these pieces down, and I'll see you guys then. All right. So now that I've got that done, what I'm gonna try to do now is I'm gonna try to make the. Uh, the like normal center line lines and uh yeah so let's get into that part of this video i'm gonna just do another time lapse for that i just realized how much of a waste this is of electric electric tape but whatever <laughs> So here it is right now. It's uh, it's pretty interesting. Now I have to do this area right here, um, the threshold right here. I don't know if I'm actually gonna detail that or not, but I am gonna do the whatever they're called it's right there, and I'm gonna do the the other ones right there, and then I'm gonna do the runway number right here. So yeah, stay so tuned. I think we can get on to painting now. This will be interesting. All right, got it all painted. Now it's just time to wait until it's done drying. This will be interesting. I can't wait to see how it'll turn out. Around two hours later, it is time for the most satisfying part. Let's see if this actually worked or not. Hmm. That is satisfying. I just need to take this one off now. Boom. Not bad. I think what I'm going to do after this, so I might outline it with black. It's like a black Sharpie. So that it's a little bit more, you know, visible and stuff. But, wow. I'm actually really happy with how this is going so far. Um, 
Not sure. I would definitely recommend paint pens. If you can get them though, they're so much easier. They're so much easier to work with. I mean, it probably looks better with paint pens too. But you know, I don't have paint pens, so I just gotta work with what I've got. And holy crap, this is actually going pretty well. Holy crap. Dude, that's actually probably my best one I've ever done. I'm not even gonna lie. What the heck? I did not expect this. So, right here, I got some like really watery paint, probably from my paintbrush. And that's kind of an issue, but it's not a big problem. I can kind of just wipe it off. That's, that sucks, I should have wiped that off earlier, but I guess I didn't, so rip me, but yeah, oops, that's a problem. Hold on, I'm gonna get a paper towel and clean that up. But anyway guys, this is probably all I'm gonna do for this video. In the next, actually, I still have one more thing to take off. Boom, that's probably all I'm gonna do in this video. Stay tuned for the next actual airport update. And yeah, so in the next update, I might actually outline it because it isn't fully dried yet, but I thought it was about time that I can take the, the thing off, you know? So yeah, but yeah, that looks amazing. I'm actually really impressed. Yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video, bye.